Let me show you how you can actually use the Canva Pro Elements for free, totally free. Let's go right into the video, guys. Hey, wonderful people. Hey, guys, welcome or welcome back to my channel. So in today's video, I'll be showing you how you can use Pro Elements on Canva without paying. So this is how I maneuver my way through Canva using the pro elements without actually paying a dime. And I can save my picture or save my um, image to my gallery. So I'm just going to show you how you can do that. First things first, we're just going to search for what we want to do. If you want to make like a thumbnail and you have like elements you want to use on Canva, but you can't use them because they are all on pro version this is the way you can do it so we're heading now to creating a thumbnail so we're actually starting from the scratch so i'm just going to put in like the different pro elements we can actually use as we go to plus sign tap on the element and it depends on what you're looking for for example let's search for subscribe button good so there are different options but all these are pro you can i'm just going to tap on this one this is a pro subscribe button first of all you know that you want to make like you want to use some of them used to have like watermarks some of the pro versions of um these elements used to have watermarks but if you're using a subscribe button it doesn't have to be really really big where you can obviously see the canva watermark on it so you have to reduce the size a little bit at least it's too obvious you can see see the like and subscribe but you can't see the watermark so we have one here we're just going to leave it on the screen but if you're making a thumbnail you can actually put this in a position where you want it to be and maybe add other images and other elements and arrange it the way you want but for the sake of this tutorial i'm just i just want to show you how you can actually use a lot of different elements without pain so we're just going to head over and search for a different pro element on canva so what else are we going to search for let's just say tiktok logo so there are lots of tiktok logos here let's just go with the first one that has a pro so this is it if you expand it more there is no way you want to make your tiktok logo this big on your thumbnail so you have to always adjust it to be small so this way the watermark doesn't even show that it's a watermark so you can use it like this this is the second one we're just going to keep them all on the screen but we're just going to add as many as we can and I'll show you how you can actually use them without paying. Let's choose this one. This is a pro plant. You see, you can actually use them. Just reduce it a little bit. And if you want to make it like long, you can duplicate it and just arrange it how you want your design to be. You know, it depends on how you want your design to be. So all these elements on my screen are pro, but we're going to use them for free. So we keep we keep adding more depends on what you're trying to create depends if you're making like a thumbnail or you're making like a youtube banner whatever you want to create with canva all these applies you can use this pro elements for free so after adding all your pro elements and it's time for you to save what you have to do is to go to the download button so this is what comes up they try to tell you that your design contains premium content and you have to pay before you can do this this is what you will do to get the free version or to get your image downloaded just download with watermarks tap on this option download with watermarks and you have your image saved to your gallery without you paying for this pro element on um canva there is another way you can also do it. I'll show you when this saves to our gallery. Yay! Our image has been saved to our gallery. So let me show you a different way. There are two options for saving. So let's use the second option and see what comes up. Yeah. So you go to the download. Download. Now when this shows up, have to tap on these three dots. 
then you see the second option download a free watermark draft this is the option you have to click on and it automatically saves your design without you paying amazing it has been saved to our gallery now let's head over to our gallery to see if it has any watermark on it wow so these are uh, this is our image with the pro cam with the pro elements as you can see you can't really see the watermarks on it so thank you so much guys for watching i hope you learned something today please don't forget to hit the subscribe button if you did turn on your notification and give this video a thumbs up and leave a comment in the comment section i'll see you again in my next video bye bye oh, I want you. Oh